Hey everybody, welcome to this week's edition of Let's Talk Teens with Dr. Keela. And of course, I am your host, Dr. Keela, board certified family practitioner, speaker, and award-winning author of your favorite book, Nia and the Numbers Game, A Teenager's Guide to Education, Relationships, and Sex. So today I'm going to do a little bit of a departure from my usual Let's Talk Teens content. And today is going to be Let's Talk Stats with Dr. Keela. I decided instead of talking about Black History Month, I wanted to talk about some interesting little st statistics about our country here in the United States. And so those of you who have joined, this is going to be a little bit interactive. So by all means, when I ask some questions about these statistics, Give me your comments in the chat. So first question, how many zip codes do you think there are in the United States? Hey, the Beast and Chris, Sharif, thanks for joining the live stream. So let's see what you guys think. How many zip codes are there in the country? Now I will tell you, I guessed a thousand and that was an underestimation. Anybody want to take a guess in the comments? All right, the answer is 42,000 zip codes. And one of those is for the Empire State Building. That's right, the Empire State Building has its own zip code. All right. Another statistic. All right, Mickey, you said 6,000. Still, you were, you were underestimating it. All right, number two. What is the percentage of adults in the United States who are obese? So what percentage of U.S. adults are obese? Anybody want to take a guess? Do you think it's... 5%, 10%, 50%, any idea? The answer is 40%. Yikes, as a doctor, that concerns me. Next question. When it comes to pizza and how much Americans consume pizza, it would take up, on average, 100 acres. If you spread out all the pizzas that we eat per day in America, it's 100 acres. Maybe that is contributing to the 40% obesity rate, right? All right, next question. At any given time, how many people do you think are in the U.S. airspace? meaning they're traveling on planes or helicopters. How many people, if you just had to guess? And this is in the thousands. All right, Mickey, you said 99, like 99,000, I'm assuming. Sixty-one thousand. Can you imagine that? All right, last question. Which state in the United States has rated has been rated as the happiest state? So they have the happiest people there. Unfortunately, it's not my home state of Georgia, so we can eliminate that one. <laughs> so you've got 49 other states to choose from. Which state is the happiest? And let's see what you guys say in the comments. No one's voting for their state. Virginia? No, Mickey, it's not Virginia. We'll try one more. So we're down to 48. <laughs> All right, you guys, the answer, Utah. And believe it or not, I had a patient just yesterday whose daughter lives in Utah and she brought in some gorgeous pictures. So I think maybe I need to be one of those 61,000 people <laughs> on um, a plane headed to Utah. 
All right, everybody, this concludes this week's edition of Let's Talk Teens and Let's Talk Stats with Dr. Keela. Just wanted to do something fun today. I'll see you all next week. Bye now.